50 Excel formulas in 50 days, day 35. Today, we want to find out who is the second highest salaried employee. If there are multiple, print all of their names as well as what is the second highest salary. But the problem is we have got data with ties. So here you can see that the first highest salary is shared by two people and the second highest salary is shared by these two people. So in this case, we want to get these two names. So this is how we do it. First, we add this dense rank column. To do this, we are going to use the let function, let and create a temporary variable called unique vals, which is nothing but unique of all the salaries. And then we are going to count how many such unique values are more than or equal to the current salary in this row. For this, we can use the sum function, sum minus minus open bracket, unique vals greater than or equal to at the rate salary. Close all these brackets and when you hit enter, you are going to get the dense rank. So wherever there is a tie, the rank will be shared. So first rank will be for two people. Second rank will be for two more people, three, four, like that. Now that we have got the dense rank, everything else is really simple. We use the XLOOKUP function, XLOOKUP2 among these ranks and get the corresponding salary. That will give us 82,100. And to print the names, we are going to use the text join with comma space and filter all the names where the salary is equal to this value here. Close all these brackets and we'll get the names there. Let's see what this is for five. We'll get three names. How cool is this?